Good afternoon. I'm Professor Andrew Deeks, President of University College Dublin. On behalf of my fellow faculty and staff, I wish to extend a warm welcome to this virtual conferring, especially to our students, your families and friends, and to your supporters far and wide. I'm delighted to be joined by the Principal of the UCD College of Health and Agricultural Sciences, Professor Cecily Kelleher, and by the Dean of Agriculture and Head of the UCD School of Agriculture and Food Science, Professor Alex Evans. This is a meeting of the University gathered for the conferring of degrees. A quorum is present and I now call upon Professor Evans to commence the proceedings. Thank you, President. And on behalf of my colleagues at the UCD School of Agriculture and Food Science, I would like to reiterate the President's warm welcome to you all this afternoon. The day of the conferrings is the most significant one for everyone in the school, students, faculty and staff. It marks the culmination of four years of work on your part and is recognition of each individual achievement and is of course a celebration. Usually, but not guaranteed, the weather is kind and everyone gathers around O'Reilly Hall and the lake for photos. Like so much over the last 18 months, this time is different with graduation reflecting your experiences this year, where we have to celebrate remotely rather than in person, with the promise of having you back to celebrate in the school when times allow. I, on behalf of all my colleagues, want to acknowledge your academic achievements, in particular your resilience and self-reliance, well done for staying the course. We are disappointed not to be with you today, we are proud of you and congratulate you on your graduation. Before we commence, I will explain the procedure which we will follow. The candidates on whom degrees are conferred are graduands. That is, they have fulfilled the requirement and are proceeding to their degree. The Principal of the College of Health and Agricultural Sciences, Professor Cecily Kelleher, will present the graduates for the degree. In response to the presentation, the President, Professor Andrew Deeks, will confer the degree. The candidates have then become graduates. Professor Kelleher will read in Latin and the President will respond in Latin to her. I will then call the names of our new graduates. Honours Degree of Bachelor of Agricultural Science. Pre honorables praises, totaque universitas. Presento vobus hasque, meas filias, filiosque meos, quos omnes scio, tam moribus, quam doctrina, habilis et adonius esse, qui ad betantor ad gradum baccalaureatus in scientiae agriculturae. Honoro curso confecto, id quae tibi fide mea testor, ac spondeo totique academiae. Ego octoritate mihi concessa, mito voad gradum baccalaureatus in scientia agriculturae honoro curso confecto. Thank you both. Agricultural systems technology. Richard Dehane. Edward Dre, Vincent Fox, Claudia McCormick, Agri Environmental Science, Hannah Blandford, Alison Burke. Laura Brady, Robert Byrne, Sam Condon, Hugh Cronin, 
Emer Deary. Shaobu Du. Mark Fitzpatrick. Dylan Floyd. Zhu Hao Yu. Kieran Hoey. Taekwon Huang, Li Kai Zheng, Michael Launders, Jinran Li, Yu Zhang Lin, Ashling McNamee. Liam Murray, Aoife O'Brien, Sarah Quinn, Alexander Round, Fergal Scully, Stephen Triggs, Jai Cheng Wang, Padraig Whelan. In animal and crop production, Grania Ahern, Noel Barden, Lauren Barry. Dervila Brown, Sarah Burke, Maria Byrne, Brian Cahill, Adele Cashman, Michael Clancy, James Cleary, Aidan Coffey, John Joe Collins, Laura Daly, Liam Daw, Podrick Dillon, Deirdre Deville, Kevin Dolan, Rachel Donovan, Michael Doran, Thomas Dunn, Ellen Durkin. Neve Fitzgerald, Michael Ben Fitzsimons, Ernon Flannery, Andrew French, Sean Grork, Andrew Hanbidge. Mike Healy, Dennis Healy, Joseph Hogan, Thomas Howlett, Niall Hughes, Podrick Joyner, Neve Keane, Dylan Keane, James Kelly, Dana Lancaster, Padraig Leamy, Dermot Lee, 
Owen Leonard, Laura Maloney, Killian McAvoy, Roisin McManus, Kian Minogue, Kira Malloy, Stephen O'Donnell, Patrick O'Donoghue, Jamie O'Driscoll, Arnold O'Dwyer, Duan O'Grady, John O'Neill, Thomas O'Sullivan, Kate Purcell, Sean Raftery, George Ryan, Shauna Ryan, Connor Sheehan, Roisin Stevenson, Kevin Tobin, Sean Tonra, Thomas White, Owen Wins. Animal Science. Mike Breen. Rosemary Brennan. Padraig Broderick. Gavin Byrne. Kevin Byrne. Emily Crowley. Maeve Cuff. Orla Daly. Emma Dooley. Chloe Dowling Foy. Shane Dunn. Charles Dwan. Breed Gary. Neve Garvey. Dara Giblin. Rachel Hannon. Hannah Healy. David Judge. Samuel Kavanagh. Sinead Kearns. Shania Keveney. Emma Kilmartin. Athena Kumarianos. Avine Lenahan. Sarah Loges. Michael McDermott. Aoife McDonough. Orla McParland. Evie McTagg. Ashling Myers. Zoe Nelson. Sinead Nilon. Marie O'Rourke. Tom O'Sullivan. Daniel Quinlan. Rebecca Redding. 
Kira Ryan. Stephen Shannon. Kieran Sheehan. Helen Stafford Wilson. Podrick Walsh. Jamie Warren. Animal Science Equine. Julia Casados. Sinead Edwards. Grace McKenna. Sinead Parmentier. Keela Redmond. Megan Sheedy. Abigail Sheridan. Charlotte Warner. In Dairy Business, Podrick Blake, Clive Booth, Dara Brady, Mary Kate Condren, Owen Daly. Shane Dolphin, Shane Galligan, Kevin Kyo, Katie Larkin, John Mahan, Aoife Murray, Clifford Neal, Liam Quirk, Dermot Ryan, Matthew Ryan, Michael Swan. Food and Agribusiness Management. James Byrne, Peter Boylan, Michael Brady, Tig Brennach, Hannah Burke, Kyle Kerr. Emily Kenny, Rebecca Coonan, Owen Coyle, Robert Dix, Neve Dunphy, Neil Fitzsimons. Jessica Friday, Kian Gahan, Chloe Harrison, Helen Hoynes, Isabel Jones, Dara Kennedy. Kira Langton, Kevin Marr, Ruin McDonnell, Sarah McIntosh, Molly Mooney, Jack Moore. Simon Mordund, Neve Mulhern, Jamie Murphy, 
Kieran Murphy. Tyg Murta. Caleb Powell. James Ray. Lucy Reed, Edmund Ryan, Susan Shackleton, Hebe Scheel, Rory Smith, Kevin Stone, David Thorpe, Owen Tobin, James Toner, Daniel Trass, Noel Walsh, Adam Walsh, Billy Wickham, Emma Young, and in forestry, Sean Adini, Kevin Kyo, Kenneth Moore, Brendan Mulry, Emma Riley, Dara Wire. In horticulture, landscape, and sports turf management, Yu Ying Bi, Yan Chong Chen. Aaron Dunn, Owen Farnan, Stuart Gordon, Yan Chen Guo, Qi Jin Li, Hao Jun Liang, Ning Lin, Donal McGrath, Chu Ki Ni, Ru Jing Pan, Jay Ming Shu, Jamie Swanton. Qi Ying Wu, Qing Ji, Yu Du Ji. Honours Degree of Bachelor of Science. Honours Degree of Bachelor of Science. Pre Honorables Praces, Totoque Universitas. Presento Vobus Hasque, Meas Filias, Filiosque Meus, Quos Omnes Scio, Tamoribus Quam Doctrina, Habilis et Adonius Esse, Quia Betantor, Ad Gradum, Baccalaureatus Scientiae. Honoro corso confecto, itque tibi fide mea testor, ac spondeo, totique academiae. Ego, octoritate mihi concessa, emita voad gradum baccalaureatus in scientia honoro corso confecto. Thank you both. Food science. Malak Ali. Kira Barden, Nicola Barton, Sh 
Sinead Belton. Liam Bickers. Ben Bradley. Ashling Brennan. Yaming Kai. Ellen Condren Kuipers. Barry Connolly. Isabel Connors. Shona Cosgrove. Kate Deegan. Robin Dempsey Daly. Stephen Donnelly. Killian Donahoe. Jack Doran. Megan Ennis. Roger Fagan. Matilda Fennell. John Gallagher. Sive Griffin. Yin Hu. Cloda Lee. Chu Han Lee. Yao Shen Liang. Lucy Lochlan. Clara Lynch. Danielle Maguire. Claudia McCabe. Maraid McCabe. Lorcan McGrath. Kira McQuillan. Jessica Meats. Grace Mongi. Jin Kwan Mu. Susan Mooney. May Mulholland. Ethna Murray. Michaela Nelson. Leisha O'Flanagan. Therese Sweeney. Aaron Tooley. Jack Vallum. Sarah Walsh. Yaping Wen. David Wilson. Shangbei Yu. Cheng Yuan Zhong. In human nutrition, Leisha Bennis. Duran Brennach. Sophie Buggy. Sophie Callanan. Sinead Cleary. Hannah Cody. Shivra Dooley. Tian Zhu Feng. Laura Geraghty. Alana Horgan. Beth Hughes. Shenda Hughes. Ruth Jeffers. 
Grace Kearns, Aileen Kerrigan, Cuiva Lennon, Fionn McAndrew, Alexandra Mezniska, Sarah Miller, Molly Mulligan, Gracie Nashrala, Cleana Nikonikon, Ruth Nolan, Alice O'Brien, Anna Maria Oxenti, Emma Power, Evan Stevenson, Rachel Tobin, and Veterinary Nursing, Richard Lynch, Stephanie McDonnell. And now the professional diploma. Professional diploma. Pre honorables praises, totaque universitas. Presento vobus hasque, meas filias, filiosque meos, quos omnes scio, tam moribus quam doctrina, hablas et adonias esse, qui admitantur ad diploma professionale. Itque tibi fide mea testor, ac spondeo totique academiae. Ego, auctoritate mi concessa, admitto voia diploma professionale. Thank you both. In food safety and quality, Kashif Ahmed, Nina El Daba, Nelly Flores, Lisa Hendrick, Syed Hassan, Nadezda Ivanina, Manhar Kalra, Ahmed Katab. Chen Chil Ko, Laura Lee, Victor Lo Ken Song, Michael Lo, Carolina Lozano Guajardo, Annette Plellinger. Svetlana Pliaskovskaya, Maria Guadalupe Sanchez Romero, AJ Sangi, Jason Shellhas, Victoria States, Samir Talsania. Mariana Utrera. Now the degree of Masters of Agricultural Science. Pre honorables praises, totaque universitas. Presento vobus hasque, meas filias, filiumque meum, quo scio tam moribus, Quam doctrina habilis et idoneus esse, qui admitantur ad gradum magisterii in scientiae agriculturae, itque tibi fide mea testor, ac spondeo totaque academiae. 
Ego octoritate mihi concessa, mita viad grada magisteri in scientia agriculturae. Thank you both. Agricultural Extension and Innovation. Mark Freeman. Martin Ryan. Lauren Stephen. And now the degree of Master of Science, Agriculture. Degree of Master of Science, Agriculture. Pre honorables praises, totaque universitas. Presento vobis hasque, meas filias, filiosque meos, quos omnis scio, tam moribus quam doctrina, habilis et idoneus esse, qui admitantur ad gradum magisterie scientiae agricultura, it quae tibi fide mea testor, ac spondeo totaque academiae. Ego, octoritate mihi concessa, mita voad grada magisteri scientia agricultura. Thank you both. In environmental resource management, Andrea De Lorenzi. By research, Mairead Quinn. The degree of Master of Science. Degree of Master of Science. Pre honorables praesis, totaque universitas. Presento vobis hasque, meas filias, filiosque meos, quos omnes scio, tam moribus quam doctrina, habilis et idoneus esse, qui admitantur ad gradum, Magisteriae scientiae, itque tibi fide mea testor, ac spondeo totique academiae. Ego, octoritate mihi concessa, admita vo ad grada magisteri scientiae. Thank you both. In food, nutrition and health, Maeve Bulger. Megan Buggy, Katie Byrne, Alice Coulson, Maria Coyle, Genevieve Davis, Sean Delaney, Mary Donlan, Siobhan Duffy, Emma Duncan, Siobhan Ellison, Morgan Foley, Christanthi Kalusha, Tristan Kennedy, Philip Kinsler, Sarah Jane Lawler, Shan Law, Jennifer McCarthy, Rebecca Mellett, Taya Mifsud, Kira Mitchell, Breed Murphy, Louise Nicholson, Anne Marie Nolan, Anne Nugent. 
Ruth O'Brien. Pauline O'Connor. Katie O'Driscoll. Aoife Margaret Mary O'Shea. Aoife O'Shea. Anya O'Sullivan. Kira O'Toole. John Quigley. Ashling Ryan. Anna Loed Silvertand. Alison Smith. Elena Soto Del Pecho. Eleftheria Sapu. Alfanella Toledo Urtal Rabinho. Christina Valor. Megan Walsh. Alva Walsh. And by research, Hannah Rossiter. The degree of Doctor of Philosophy. Degree of Doctor of Philosophy. Pre honorables praesis, totaque universitas. Presento vobus hasque, meas filias, filiosque meus. Quos omnes scio, tam moribus quam doctrina, habilis et adonius esse. Qui ad metantor ad gradum, Doctoratus Philosophiae, itque tibi fide mea testor, axpondeo totique academiae. Ego, octoritate mihi concessa, mito voad gradum doctoratus philosophia. Thank you both. Elizabeth Carthy. Dr. Carthy's thesis title is Exploring How Aid Organizations' Efforts to Address Sexual Exploitation and Abuse by Aid Workers Engage Survivors' Victims. Kevin Cunningham. Dr. Cunningham's thesis title is An Evaluation of How Academic Student Engagement Can Be Enhanced in Agricultural Education. And that concludes the conferring of degrees. I'm now delighted to welcome Minister for Transport and Minister for the Environment, Climate and Communications, Eamon Ryan TD, to address you. He is leader of the Green Party and a proud alumnus of UCD, graduating with a BCom. He also founded the original Belfield Bike Shop, and we are indeed honoured that he will address us today. Hello. I'd like to say well done and con congratulations to everyone today graduating from the School of Agriculture, Food Science and Human Nutrition in University College Dublin. I'd say first of all, well done to having got here, whether it's to getting your PhD, Masters or your undergraduate degree. It's a hugely important, significant day for you. And you've done it at an incredibly difficult time. The last two years, where we've had to work remotely, have lectures, learn online, do things in a completely different way, has been, must have been really challenging. And for getting here, for getting through the degree, getting everything done, I just have to say, well done. If you've managed this and able to overcome all the challenges in the last two years particularly, you can overcome anything that's ahead of you. My experience, I was graduate of UCD myself, about 40 years ago now, is that you're gonna need that flexibility. You're going to need that ability to change and adapt. No one knows exactly what comes next. For those with the primary, primary degree, about two thirds will probably get a job. One third possibly go on into further education. And after that, after the postgraduate education, again, the world is your oyster. 
it's now time to go out and to use all the education, use the learning, use the skills that you put to such effect. And we need you. About 300 people graduating today, roughly understand. 300 people can change a lot. They've changed history in the past, and we need you now to step up and actually affect change in the real challenges facing us today. I come from a green perspective. You won't be surprised when I say one of the things you're gonna to have to manage and adapt to and affect is the ecological crisis that we're within. It's both a climate crisis, a biodiversity crisis, and a pollution crisis. The fact that our emissions are still rising, we need to have in the next decade. The fact that we've lost half of all wildlife in the last 50, 50 years by invertebrate body mass weight. Or the fact locally that we've seen some 500 rivers with pristine quality reduced down to about 20 in the same sort of time frame. We need to reverse that. We need to bring nature back. And your degrees, your skills, your learning are going to be central to meeting this challenge. If I was to give advice, I'd say, first of all, to be not to be afraid if it doesn't follow a set path. I think what we all learn after graduation is actually things some, some, sometimes work out in ways that we can never expect. You may end up in a completely different field or working in a completely different area to the one that you think you're going to go into now. Be willing to accept that. Be willing to be adapt and make changes as you go is going to be a key to what you do. I'd also say, bring with you some of the ethos and ethics and underlying philosophy that University College Dublin, in my mind, embodies. I go right back to the founder, Cardinal Newman, and his idea of a university, which I, th I still think is important and relevant and key today. How do you summarize it? It's tricky. But I think two or three points that seem to me that are really relevant still to what we need to do. Firstly, it is about engaging in the world, the real physical world. And engaging, I think, particularly with your degrees in science, in food science, in human nutrition, in forestry and agricultural science, is by being willing to be scientific, by willing to actually observe and adapt and question and not take anything for granted in the significant changes that we're going to need to make, particularly as we adopt to the ecological crisis ahead of us. Secondly, and I think this is a key point, is to bring that sense of collegiality, working with others, working with each other in a way that actually works well in a team system. That's been particularly difficult after the last two years of COVID. It's really hard. There's real advantages in being able to do things Zoom and online. But in the end, it's also important that we meet up, that you actually work together in teams as you take on new careers and new jobs. And last but not least, I'd say a lot of you are going to go into business and that business world is really important. It's really honorable. It's really key to the solutions we're going to need. But it's business that also has to be backed up with ethics, with a sense of understanding of the challenge we have ahead of us. And that it won't but just, just be reached by meeting technological or economic or purely scientific standards. We do need to come at it with a sense of purpose, a sense of protecting nature and creating a world which is sustainable in a whole variety of different ways that gives us a sense of purpose and meaning beyond just profit towards actually making a difference and being part of something where we create a home that is special, that is safe, that is sustainable and that's here to stay. Um, I hope you have a good day today. We're, you're unfortunate in the sense that we're graduating online still. We're at the verge of going to meet in person. A whole range of restrictions will be uh, relaxed in the coming weeks and months. Um, but I still hope you have a brilliant day. Uh, I hope your families uh, and your friends are proud of what you've done and that you make us proud and where you go from here. Thank you. My warmest thanks to the Minister for those inspirational words. We are now joined by two of your fellow students. Firstly, I'll call on Alexandra Mzinska, who is graduating today with a Bachelor of Science in Human Nutrition. Family, friends, lecturers, faculty, and my fellow graduates, I'm delighted to share a few words with you on our special day, albeit not the day that we'd probably anticipated. 
I'm sure none of us were expecting to be graduating from home today. This past year has been more challenging in more ways than we could have imagined. So I'd like to think of today as a testament to the dedication and resilience of each and every one of us. It does not feel like four years ago that we began this course together. We've all learned so much since then and have grown both as professionals and as individuals. Firstly, on behalf of my class, I would like to sincerely thank all of our lecturers, as well as the Dean of Agriculture, for their continued support and guidance over the last four years. Your patience, understanding and inspiration has led us to acquire an exceptional standard of knowledge and appreciation for both the Irish food and health industries. This will stand to us as we embark on the next stage of our careers. To our families and friends, who have supported us, shown us love, care and the occasional would you ever cop on when needed. We thank you also. You've always been there when times were tough and we are delighted to be celebrating this milestone together. Lastly, and most importantly, to my fellow classmates and UCD 2021 graduates, we made it. I'm so proud to be graduating with you all today. It's amazing what can be achieved in four short years. Although today is the end of one journey, I have no doubts about the bright futures awaiting all of us. So I'd like to take this opportunity to wish all of you the best of luck in whatever you find yourself doing. Congratulations and enjoy your day. Thank you, Alexandra. Now we will hear from Dermot Lee, graduating today with a Bachelor's of Agricultural Science in Animal and Crop Production. Family, friends, lecturers, members of faculty and my fellow graduates, it is a great honour to be able to share a few words with you on today, our graduation day. This isn't the graduation day we envisaged we would have, but on behalf of my classmates, I would like to express our sincere thanks to everyone who made this ceremony as memorable and as special as the current restrictions allow. Since March 2020, we've had very limited opportunity for in-person learning. This meant that online module delivery had to take place for all of our fourth year in the School of Agriculture and Food Science, and every lecturer went above and beyond the call of duty to ensure that we all received the same high level of education as the fourth years preceding us. And for this, I extend my sincerest gratitude. The guidance shown to us by all of the lecturers and the Dean of Agriculture Alex Evans will stand to us as we venture into our different career paths after life in UCD. Their exceptional standard of knowledge and appreciation for the Irish agri food sector has us well equipped for what the future challenges and opportunity that will come our way. For this, we cannot thank you enough. To all who work in the programme office, you have been unbelievable. Any student who has ever called into the programme office with a query or an issue has never left without an answer or a solution. It's a very welcoming place to go into as there's already somebody there to greet you with a smile. We extend our sincere thanks for all you have done for us over the past four years. To our families, we thank you for all you have done for us over the past four years and before that. Without your patience, understanding, encouragement and love, we wouldn't be here today. To my fellow classmates, UCD School of Agriculture and Food Science graduates 2021, I wish to congratulate you all on what is a truly wonderful achievement. These past 18 months have been difficult for everyone, but we have managed to make it to the other side. I'm sure if you all take some time to reflect on how much you have achieved academically and on a personal level, since we started as fresh faced first years, you will be all be incredibly proud of how, how, for how far we have come. I have no doubt that every one of you is going to excel in your career because as UCD graduates, you will always try and reach new heights and achieve personal goals that once seemed far away. I hope you all have an immensely enjoyable graduation day and that life after UCD is good and kind to you all. Gunnairi an Bóherlát. Thank you, Dermot. 
Now I will ask Professor Andrew Deeks, UCD President, to address you. Congratulations once again and enjoy the rest of this very special day. As President of UCD, I take great pleasure and pride in extending my personal congratulations to each one of you who has graduated today. My thanks to our guests and student speakers for their inspirational words to you. This has been another year of extraordinary challenge as the world continues to deal with the impact of COVID-19. I am, however, greatly heartened by how we as a community here at UCD have responded to the crisis with creativity and innovation and with courage and compassion. It is in these most testing of circumstances that we truly show what we are made of individually and collectively. In facing the demands placed on us, we are discovering new depths to our resourcefulness and resilience. As Ireland's global university, UCD has played and continues to play a vital role in shaping our response to the pandemic nationally and globally, both culturally and scientifically. I'm proud to see how our brightest minds are rising to the challenge across all academic disciplines, from medicine, science and engineering to the arts and humanities. All around me, members of our UCD community have stepped up with courage and vision to meet the challenges of the COVID-19 pandemic, and their actions continue to underscore the vital importance of education, research and evidence-based decision-making in transforming our society. Conferring ceremonies are very special days in the calendar of the university, both for our students and for our faculty and staff marking the culmination of years of study and hard work by you, our graduates, and of the teaching and guidance by our faculty and staff. Following your graduation, you will operate in a changed world, one where your skills are in keen demand, your energy and passion are needed, and one that will warmly welcome your expertise. Here at UCD, we have almost 8,000 international students joining us from over 145 countries, adding enormously to the diversity and quality of campus life and to the UCD educational experience. We bring the best of the world to Ireland and the best of Ireland to the world. And so it's a particular pleasure for me to extend an Irish welcome to the families and friends of our international students who are joining us online today. Cade Mila Fulcher, Roeve Golair, 100,000 welcomes to you all. Our mission is to give each of you a holistic education, to inculcate in you a lifelong desire to learn and to create, and to instill in you a sense of purpose, a capacity for critical thinking, a desire to make a difference in society, and above all, an awareness of the global community in which you can make an impact. And I hope that today, as you join or rejoin the proud community of UCD graduates, you will embrace these attributes and take them with you as you embark on the next stage of your life journey. While you were students, you were at the centre of the UCD community, and as you graduate, you carry that UCD badge with you. Wear it well, use it to open doors to advance your own life's ambitions, but also extend a helping hand to those who come after you. Seek to inspire and encourage them. And above all, follow our motto, Ad Astra, to the stars, by seeking to make your own mark and your own contribution to our society. You are now a member of a very proud UCD alumni group of almost 300,000, based in 170 countries worldwide. And so, wherever your career takes you, I hope that whenever you wear the UCD crest or colours, you will remember your alma mater. I trust that in everything you do and achieve in the future, the values enshrined in UCD of creativity, excellence, integrity, collegiality, engagement and diversity will remain part of your intellectual DNA. I'm very encouraged by the government's reopening plan for the autumn 
by the lower infection rate, decrease in hospital admissions and the collapse in the mortality rate and by the pace and efficiency of the national vaccination rollout. Here at UCD, we will continue to follow the government's advice and guidelines, looking forward to a smooth return to campus as soon as it's possible and keeping everyone's health and safety at the forefront of our minds. I wish you well as you embark on your careers. Take care of yourselves and your families and take heart in the hope that we will come together again soon at the end of this journey, stronger and more united than ever. Congratulations once again. Enjoy the rest of this very special day.